defense system I have ever seen to date that is foolproof and guaranteeable. Not even what I teach. Because like, there's not. It's not against the dynamic attack. People teach shit like B-grip and C-grip and that grip and this movement. Fuck that. No way in hell. Because in all of the times I've seen people get stabbed, I've been attacked at knife point a few times, it's never been that. It's fucking big. Oh, fuck you, this kind of shit. Fuck you, man. I'll fucking cut you up. It's that. And it's so savage and fearful and brutal that your mind goes in into a complete, you got a complete brain fart, man. Literally, it's like, fuck, oh, holy shit. And you can experience, you'll feel that when the knife comes out. Because it's scary as hell. And it's treacherous because even if, you, you know, you might be grabbing, if it's a, depending on you can cut two ways, it's easy to switch hands with a knife. Very easy to switch hands. A lot of times you're not even going, you spam the metal and say, boom. And you know, you're still focused on this hand. You didn't even see me switch the hands. It's fucking brutal. It's the scariest thing. It's the last. I would rather have a guy put a gun in my face like this than pull out a knife on me. And uh, I don't push it on anybody ever. It's it's a horrible experience. Uh, and I tell people there's there's two schools of thought in our industry when it comes to knife defense. Some people say always trap the hand, the weapon hand before you strike. Other people say, no, 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 strike, 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 forget the weapon hand. And the reality is, is they're both right. Is that there are times where you have to strike, 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 and forget the weapon hand, and then there are other times that if you do that, you're gonna fucking get killed, you have to drop the knife. The, uh, the difference is, when you do it, if the knife is anywhere near you, hey, fuck okay, I told you blah, 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 you know, fucking doing this kind of shit, and now he's talking to you, then you can't just strike. Because if he strikes me here, you might be changing a lot, of fuck. Right? Boom! And I you just exchange a stab to the throat or a slice for a palm strike. So here you don't have a choice. You have to grab my weapon hand before you strike me, but you don't want me to it. You don't want me to end up as he strikes me because grab that out and cut your throat. But if my weapon hand is here, and I'm fucking ah, whatever, that kind of shit. There's I haven't found anything that's functional against this kind of assault, assault ever. That's really fully functional. There's stuff that works better than others, but nothing is like 100% functional. We've tried breaking the arm here, smashing it down, knocking it out of the way, uh, grabbing the hand. There were people who grab the hand here, it's easy to deflect and pull it in because there's that. And turning this way is about the best thing you can do to avoid, right? You still might get, you know, it still might happen. Just like I said, I've never found anything that's fully functional against that kind of an assault. And luckily, I've never ever been attacked this way. It's like full supreme style shit, right? The only thing you can do is intercept it on its way, so the fucking guy's coming here, it's should automatically jam the arm out of the as it's happening. But once it's locked in, fuck me. That's a bitch really, really difficult to defend against. I have an entire DVD where I show every possible fucking thing we can do, and I let the people who watch the DVD decide which one works best for them, and I tell them, I go, look, this is everything we came up with. See what works for you. Somebody once showed me, do it this way so you can see where the guy's grabbing here and the pump here. He said, take a fist and just bam like that. That fucking hurts. And it works, theoretically, because I tested it with so many different people and only a tiny percentage, if that much, actually thought of making a fist. Because they all scrambled. Even with the instructor going, make a fist, they, they didn't even hear it. Because it's that holy shit, and that's again the energy and the rage that is crippling. Not so much the move. 